Uh, welcome to the January 2019 Angular Seattle meetup. Uh, what is Angular Seattle? So our mission is to uh, build an inclusive, uh, supportive community of Angular developers in Seattle. Um, another one of our big goals is to develop new technical speakers uh, by giving people a, a chance to like, maybe people who haven't, who haven't spoken before, a chance to like come and speak to a group about something they've learned. Um, and we also want to run sustainably. And that means we're really volunteer driven. Uh, so you might see the same people hosting and, and organizing events, but we really count on a rotating staff um, to put these events on so that no one burns out and that we can keep going. Uh, our organizers, so the organizers that are here tonight, uh, Nicole, Chris, myself, uh, you probably met Craig as you walk, came in the door. Uh, I think Mike Moreland might be here and also Oleg um, are all people who have put on events uh, for Angular Seattle in the past. Um, and if you'd like to help out and put on more of these kind of events, please come join us. Uh, there's a link to our Slack channel. Um, also, if you don't want to put on events, if you just want to join the community and hang out, everyone's welcome. Uh, the Slack channel is a great place to meet other Angular developers in the area and to post questions you have um, and to get help with any sort of problems, uh, any sort of technical Angular problems you might need help with. So how can you get involved? Uh, the best way is to organize a meetup. We're always looking for new uh, sponsors, uh, venues, and speakers. Uh, the basics for organizing a meetup, uh, you just need a venue and you need a location kind of like this to host it. Um, you need a handful of speakers, one to three speakers. Uh, that can be yourself if you have a topic you'd like to give a, a talk on. Um, and then sponsors are always good too because we like to provide food. And if you can put all that together or you know, beg bar to get all that lined up, then you can organize a meetup and just get on Slack and let us know if you'd like to host one. Uh, but every event doesn't have to be a meetup like this. You can also host other events if you want to. Uh, so Chris, one of our organizers, um, put together some hack nights. Uh, this is something we did uh, last year a couple times. And it's sort of a web developer support group. Uh, people meet at a bar. They have like a project that they're all hacking on. And we hang out. It's a, it's a fun alternative to these kind of groups because it's more social. And you get to interact with people more. Um, and it's also a great way to get help and sort of learn things one on one. Um, so if you'd like to organize a hack night, uh, again, just let us know, and we'll put it together. And thanks, Chris, for organizing our, our past hack nights. Woo. Another way to, uh, to give back and contribute is to give a talk. Uh, giving a talk is really the best way to become an expert in something. You, you don't need to already know everything about a subject before you sign up to give a talk. And in fact, that deadline can be a really great motivator to help you to finally like, finish that project you've been uh, meaning to finish for a while. Uh, meetups like this are a great place to give a talk. This is a very, um, you know, it's a very welcoming, supportive environment. It's, it's a medium-sized, smallish crowd. Um, if you need help getting started, if you'd like to give your talk and get coaching or feedback, we're happy to help, and we're happy to like have you give your talk for us, and then give you pointers or feedback, um, and let you know if you'd if you'd like to submit a new talk. Uh, the link is bitly slash ng seattle new talk. And that goes to a form. Um, but you can also get on Slack or just meet any of the organizers one on one, and and say you'd be like you'd like to give a talk. Um, all of our past talks are on YouTube, so if you'd like to see any past talk done at uh, NG Seattle, and we didn't have a technical glitch that month, um, then the talk will be there on our YouTube page. Uh, so go check that out and subscribe. Uh, speaking of giving a talk, uh, Nicole, one of our organizers. Uh, yeah, stand up. Stand up. So uh, Nicole gave uh, a worked on a talk at the meetup, um, gave that talk at NG Atlanta, and is now speaking at NGConf this year. Um, and you too can like go on to do great things like Nicole <laughs> if you just volunteer to give a talk at NG Seattle. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. If anybody has any like questions about like my process in the last like year, uh, so where and when do we do these meetups? Um, so ideally, we want to shoot for the third Wednesday of every month. Uh, we didn't get that this month uh, because of a conflict with the space. Um, but we shoot for Wednesday. We, we try to go for the third Wednesday. Um, but that's just not always possible with the space we have. Uh, we do a quarterly sort of anchor meetup at Google. So you can count on there's always going to be a meetup January, April, July, and October 
here in this space at Google with reasonably decent food. Um, we're looking for another quarterly host, another anchor meetup like that. Uh, so if you would, if you have a venue, if your company would like to start hosting these meetups, and ideally if you have a team of two to four people who would like to help put it on um, once a quarter, please let us know because we'd, we'd love to have you um, another like regular site uh, for meetups. Um, but if you can't do regular meetups, just one-offs are great too. Uh, just get a venue and let us know. Uh, so we didn't actually have our anchor meetup in uh, October, and that's because we were doing NG Girls that month instead. Uh, so NG Girls is uh, it's an organization that does a free um, all-day Angular training uh, for women. And it's a worldwide organization. I think the day we were doing it in October, there was also Ninja Girls in Krakow and somewhere else. Yeah, yeah in like three cities. Um, so again, Nicole organized that. Thank you very much. Um, and that's what we're doing in October. And we're looking forward to doing that again this year, too. Yeah. yeah. So but right now, this is the calendar uh, for 2019. Uh, so as I said before, the anchor meetups at Google are here January, April, uh, July, and October. Uh, next month is T-Mobile. I'll get to that in a bit. Um, and we're still looking for more volunteers to host meetups. So come find us. Let us know. Uh, the next meetup is February at T-Mobile. It's February 20th at 7 p.m. Uh, thanks to Ken Burson for putting that on. And it's going to be on the east side. So we do like to do meetups uh, semi-regularly on the east side because we know it is a bad commute. We want people on both sides of the lake to have a good time. Um, and so look forward to that. We're going to be posting it to the website soon. All right, so agenda, uh, welcome. That's what we're doing right now. Uh, we like to do um, uh, hiring and, and looking for work. So if anyone's looking for an Angular job or if anyone's looking for an Angular developer, just come up and let us know. Um, and that's the part we're at now. So is anyone hiring and wants to come up and do a quick pitch? Come, come on up. Oh, you can do it. You can do it there too. Yeah. Uh, hi, I'm Brian. I'm with Supplari. We are a growth stage SaaS startup in downtown. Uh, we provide indirect customer insights for uh, a very uh, rapidly growing list of uh, customers. And we're looking for a senior uh, developer um, with uh, heavy preference towards uh, web application experience. Um, it's a good opportunity to make immediate impact. It's a growing team, but still, I think it'll be 12 engineers at this point. Um, and yeah, it's a great, it's, it's, it's a lot of opportunity to uh, exercise leadership and uh, mentoring. So if you're interested, uh, please talk to me. Great. Uh, anyone else hiring? Oh, yes, sir. Yes, you can come right up. Hello, uh, I'm Jeff. I'm from Narwhal. Uh, we, uh, I used to be on the Angular core team at Google along with my partner, Victor. Uh, we left two years ago to start Narwhal, we're, and we're always hiring Angular folks, so people who love Angular and love solving interesting challenges with Angular. Uh, let us know. We're, we're a distributed team. We've got folks in Toronto, New York, Phoenix, and all across North America. So if you want to do interesting things and solve interesting problems for interesting people, then let me know. We've got some clients here. They can tell you that uh, uh, we've helped them solve some pretty challenging things and some fun things that I think I broke the microphone just now. But, uh, um, but yeah, let me know. Thank you. All right. Yep. Can we do a slow clap? OK, too slow. OK, great. Uh, so tonight's lineup, I am really excited about. We've got uh, lots of great talks coming up. Uh, so we're going to talk about UX engineering, uh, what that role is, and specifically at Google with, with Blair. Um, we're going to talk about progressive web apps and the ocean um, with Will Smith. Uh, not that one, but th this one. Um, and then we're going to be uh, debugging Angular applications with Augury with Asan. Uh, so, so great. So let's go ahead and get started and have Blair talk, teach us about UX engineering. Nice to say to Blair. Yeah.